Eco, we brought you here because we have an extremely stupid hostage situation. We thought you would be best suited to take this crazy lunatic out. You might not like who it is, however. As a kid, you are no doubt a fan of his work. You're gonna have to put your feelings behind you, though, and put this bear on ice. We've got the file on him right here for you to look at. I think I smell hate. I think I smell destruction. from Doc Hogg. Now, even with autism, I know better than to trust strangers. I'll never have another shot again. Oh, don't worry. I've got a different kind of shot for you. Bring it, you little punk. Boyfriend. I didn't take you as the type to be swayed to stand guard by your captor, but I guess I was wrong. Well, given my contract with Assassin Corp and how our relationship ended, I'm not gonna feel bad about this at all. Corners of my mind, always raining, all the time. You can't possibly understand my anguish. So much is expected of bears in this country. It's time to stop riding the unicycle they call life. The honeycomb has turned bitter. The line between fantasy and reality is blurring. And this house shall soon join me in the fires of hell. Jeez Louise, Bear, what would Henson think about all this? If you can't help yourself, think about all the kids you haven't shotgun yet. There's still time to set things right and get off with a slightly lighter sentence. Oh, Pico, I'd love to see you try to stop me now.
Well done, Pico. You shorted out the bomb and blew up the bear. What do you say we go out for ice cream? This one's on me. You can pay next week. 